With the release of the new Xbox Series X and the PS5, console gamers are getting a whole new look into the power of gaming. Now, both of these machines are going to be able to push out 4K resolution at 120 frames per second or 120 hertz on your TV. And as more and more of these games are coming out, you're going to really see this taken advantage of over the next few years on these consoles. But TVs that can handle the 4K resolution and the 120 frames per second are pretty expensive right now, at least in my opinion. So let's just imagine that you just bought your Xbox Series X, there's about a $500 purchase right there. You wanted to buy an extra controller and maybe you wanted to buy another one or two games that are going to go along with your Xbox Series X. You're looking at, you know, roughly around $700 in order to do that. So do you really have another $1,000, $1,500 or more to go out and purchase yourself a brand new TV that can handle these things? Which brings us to the discussion that we're going to have today. So a lot of us already maybe have a TV, maybe you recently upgraded, you know, like a year or so ago to a 4K TV, or perhaps you still have a 1080p TV, but it can handle 120 hertz. Which way should you go when you're going to buy your new Xbox Series X? You know, we get this question a lot in the comments and they're asking, you know, hey, I have a 1080p TV, but it can do 120 hertz. Should I utilize that? Or I have a 4K TV, but it does not have 120 hertz. Should I use, utilize the resolution instead of going with the higher frame rates or maybe dropping it down to 1080 with the higher frame rates? So let's go ahead and have that discussion today. And that's what we're going to do right now. So personally, I believe this ultimately comes down to your personal preference on whether you like to go with more graphics or whether you want to go with higher frames per second or higher hertz on your TV. But let's go ahead and go over some of the options that may sway you to use one way or another. So one thing you want to consider when you're looking at which way to go is what type of game you're actually playing. So if you're playing a really fast paced game, something like a Call of Duty, uh, then you may want to consider using the lower resolution option so that you can have the higher frame per second or a higher refresh rate on your TV and utilize that so that you have that frame rate going at the speed that you need to because it's such a fast twitch shooter you really need each one of those frames going as fast as possible um, so that you can have the advantage or at least the same level of advantage as someone else who has that 4k and 120 frames per second tv maybe you don't get quite as good of resolution that's the sacrifice there but you also want to have that higher frames per second another option might be something like dirt 5 when you're playing that game and you're going really fast and the turns stuff like that having that frames per second can keep any type of uh, screen tearing issues from happening. And so maybe you, again, you wanna lower that resolution keep the frames per second instead. Okay, and so on the flip side of that, maybe you have a 4K TV and you're playing a game like Ori and you wanna know whether you should keep the highest resolution or should you go ahead and drop down to 1080p and try to raise that frame rate again in this scenario. And in my opinion, I don't think you should drop the resolution. I think the creators of this game, you know, really went for that artistic and high quality resolution. And you should keep that at 4K and, you know, really take advantage of looking at the beautiful picture that they uh, designed for you guys. So in my opinion, in this case, I would leave it at the 4K resolution and not worry about dropping it down a resolution to 1080p so that you get that higher frame rate. I don't think it's gonna really make a difference for you in this type of game. So with all of that, how does this apply to you? So like I mentioned, it really is a personal preference. I just think, you know, depends on how you like to personally uh, game. Now, in my opinion, I, I again, as I kind of explained earlier, I do believe it's going to depend on the situation you're in. For me personally, when I'm playing something like Call of Duty, I would prefer to maybe lower my resolution and have that higher frame rate. And then vice versa, again, like I keep saying, in something like Ori, where I really want to enjoy that picture quality, I'm going to leave it at that 4K resolution and then leave it at the lower frame rate. So whatever fits your gaming needs, the options are going to be there. But what I want to know is what do you prefer? Do you prefer having the higher frame rates or do you prefer having the higher resolution? Let me know in the comments below. Now, if you are looking to upgrade your TV, I do have a whole series of videos right here which can help you hopefully decide which one you should upgrade to. I recently went ahead and took out my Samsung 80 that I had and I put that into my business and I went ahead and got me the LG C1 that I really, really wanted to get. So I finally broke down and went ahead and got that. So that's what you see behind me now, guys. So that was my choice, but if you have a different choice and you wanna know what else is out there, then make sure you watch this video series coming up on the screen next. So with that said, guys, thank you so much for watching this video as always, and I will see you in the next one.